Greetings, one and all. Welcome back to NHL 19 Be A Pro Mode with Liam Kirk. Yes, we are back here again to carry on the professional playing career of the British hockey phenom. Last episode, we were moved up to the third line of the Arizona Coyotes. We scored a goal in our last game against Edmonton. And then we had our first NHL fight after we laid a massive hit on Connor McDavid that knocked his helmet off. Milan Lucic tried to come and do some damage to us. But we got the job done and beat up Milan Lucic. And we are going nine points in ten games, I believe, if we just double check this. Yeah, yeah, I think it's nine points in ten games. We've played ten games in the NHL. Uh, there's about another 15, 18 games or so for the Arizona Coyotes in this season. Yes, 9 points in 10 games, 5 goals, 4 assists, and we're a minus 1, and we have the second highest shooting percentage on the team so far this season. So, we're looking to try and get some more wins uh, in the lineup, I think. Uh, whilst Kirk has been playing relatively well, the team since he's joined hasn't, if you know what I mean. Um, we managed to win. We won a couple of games last episode, but we've, we're have we coming off an overtime loss and then two straight losses. So we need we need to pick it up a little bit as we approach the trade deadline, where the trade deadline is on the 26th against Florida. So let's see how we do. Um, the Arizona Coyotes, they are now tied with Vegas for the uh, wild card spot. However, Vegas have played two more games, so we need to try and get some wins here so we can take over Calgary and maybe even LA if we're lucky. But anyway, game number one of the episode against the Vancouver Canucks. Let's do this, boys. So, step on against Jay Beagle for the opening face-off of the first game of this episode. First period. Okay, it's a one nothing lead. Pellini scores on Thatcher Demko. Guilford board lad. Nine, uh, 11 shots to 9, I should say, in favour of the Arizona Coyotes. Second period. Okay, and then Golagosti scores on Thatcher Demko. So, it's a 2 nothing lead here for the Arizona Coyotes. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> famous last words, famous last words. We're going to lose now, aren't we? I've proper jinxed that for us. Oh, it's going to be exciting though, isn't it, guys, to see how we lose. As long as I'm not on the ice for any of the goals scored against, I'm happy. <laughs> well, I, I would prefer it if Arizona made the playoffs, obviously, but let's see how we do. <laughs> right, here we go. So, C+, 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 new line. Let's see how you perform on this line. Well, I scored a goal last game. So I'm starting to pick up the points here. I'm almost averaging a point per game so far in my NHL career. A minute 30 into the third period and Kirky's line is up. Off you get Pellini. You've already scored a goal this game. Okay, Bo Horvat, Sven Betsky. Is Elias Pettersson on this lineup? Oh, that's a good hit to get him out of the way. Just clearing that, that ice, you know. Okay, to me. Good pass, boy. Come on, defense. Try me. Try me. Okay, uh, not that much. How was that an offensive turnover when my guy picked up the puck? Oh, good one-timer attempt there, boy. Pouliot, lovely little play there. Oh, oh, uh, good shot. Good shot attempt there. It's mine. Okay, you got it. No, you got it. Okay, I got it. Oh, that almost got flicked into the goal again. Fisher, careful. Haul that. Get hit. This is some great pressure in our zone. This is some great pressure in our zone. Oh, oh their zone, sorry. The forecheck is incredible today. Oh, no, that was a bad call for a pass. I tried to flick it in. God, that was some good pressure there, boys. What a great first shift for the third line. C plus, C plus, C plus. I mean, a couple of bad calls for passes and all that. A couple of shots that could have gone a bit better. But we kept the puck in their zone for a sustained period of time. Kept them on their heels, tied out their players. So good job, boys. Good job. Okay, who's got the puck? Roussel. Antoine Roussel, former Dallas star. The Frenchie. You would have thought he would have gone to play in French Canada. But he didn't. Right, to me, go. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting fact of the day. <laughs> right, careful, careful. No, it's my puck. Good, pass it out there. Good play. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, good shot attempt. Oh, come on, Fisher. Get your stick in there. Whack it in the back of the net. Get me an assist, boy. I'm trying my best here. I'm getting some good attempts on that. That was a great pass from the defenseman, though. We've lost our last three games. Stop reminding me, game. Careful, Fisher. Okay, who's got it? You've got it. Get out of my way, Vancouver Canuck. Leave me alone. All right, careful. Carefully does it. I'm marking my man, and that's a goal. Really? And of course I'm on the ice for it. Like, players, you're supposed to... How is that bad line defense? I was standing right in the area of the ice that the game always tells me to stand in. I don't see how that's my fault. Ah, right, come on, boys. I don't know who that pass was to. Wasn't sure as hell wasn't to me. 
Okay, good poke check. Good poke check. Hutton, you are getting hounded on this puck, bud. Give us that puck, matey. That was an awful defensive play. Careful. Right, I'm covering my man. I'm over here covering my man. Good job. And Fisher loses the puck immediately. That's what I like to see, fellas. To me. Let's actually get some space with this puck. Let's try what we did last last episode. Oh, good shot there on Thatcher Demko. Covers up for the face. Oh, hey, hey, fellas. Let's, let's calm it down, boys. Let's calm it down. Okay, we're up against Winnipeg, Florida, and Vancouver. Oh, we're up against Vancouver again in this episode. But we'll be simulating that, that game, I believe. So, 9.02 left in the period. Jolmerson with four blocked shots so far. Good job, dude. We really need that. Go on, a good, uh, good win, in a face-off win in the offensive zone would have been helpful. Careful. Don't give them an easy rebound, Ranta. Okay, let's lose that puck too. Very helpful. Okay, right in front of the net. <laughs> what are we doing? I just want one more. One more skate up the ice, coach. One more. Oh, over the net. Right, I'm, I'm taking the line change, coach. Thought I'd do it while we were in their zone. Be smart about it, you know. B minus C plus C plus. So he's appreciating my offensive efforts. Oh, that one should have been more aimed at the net. I should have had something out of that one. So 522 left in the period. Oh, it's a penalty kill. We just can't help ourselves in this game, can we? Ah, <laughs> oh, we try everything we can, but we still can't win. I don't think Pettersson's on this line, on this team, actually. I knew it was going to go to you. Good, good. Go, Kirky. Go, Kirky. Come on, here we go. Here we go. Forehand, backhand. No, I didn't actually get the backhand off. Come on. Right, that's a good poke check. Back to me. Back to me. Right, it's mine. It's mine. Don't you push me off that puck, Stetcher. You're nothing. Oh, I had a breakaway on the penalty kill and I couldn't pull it to the backhand. Why? Oh, it's such a pain in the ass, Kirky. You had a chance there, boy. You had it. That was yours. You were off to the races. But you just couldn't do it. God's sake. All right, cover your man. Cover your man. Good play. Okay, you could have sent it straight up the ice to me. Why are we sending it round the board so many times? The defense in this game really sucks ass. What are you doing? Okay, clear that puck out. You're welcome. Right, I'm going for a line change. <laughs> oh, I still can't believe I didn't score on that bloody, ah, bloody thing. Can't even remember what it's called now. Breakaway, that's what it's called. Right, 3.50 left in the game. Still on the penalty kill. The coach just won't give me five seconds off. Right, get me back on the ice then. Hello, Garnier. I was about to call him Gagner. I know that's not his name. Oh, we don't need another slap shot from the point scoring. Careful! Really, team? This, this is how we're playing this? My god. This team sucks defensively. <laughs> Oh, coach, let me go off the ice. I know you're liking my play, but I'm exhausted. I want to get an empty net chance too. Oh, my God. Please save that. Thank you, anti Ranta. Oh, talk about keeping us in this game, fella. Coach, let me go off. I know there's a penalty kill, but Jesus Christ. Just let me go off. I've had enough. Oh, that's a good defensive turnover. Over to you. Offside. God damn it, that would have been a lovely pass. B minus C plus C plus. So I did my job on the penalty kill. Get me out there for an empty net goal. Ah, uh, my shift's going to be too long. God damn it. Well, it depends actually. Right, I'm in. Okay. Pass to me. Great pass, bud. Okay, where am I going? Where? Oh, what the hell was that? He didn't even make a poke check. Good back check though. My offensive turnovers really need to improve. Okay, good to me. Lovely. You're going to come towards me or not? I'll take that as a yes. God damn you, Tanev. Ah, <laughs> oh, right. Come on. Pull your net. Pull your goalie now so I can go and score. Or not. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm in my position. Ranta. Oh, Ranta, you almost put that in your own net, buddy. Please don't do that. Okay, give me one more shift game. One more shift is all I need. Ah, oh, there you go. A 2-1 victory for the Arizona Coyotes. Finally, we come off our losing streak and get the victory. I don't think I actually did anything in this game, to be honest. My offensive turnovers were a bit poor. Yeah, it wasn't my best game. Um, defense, I got a load of stuff. But other than that, I didn't really do too much. Ranta and Galchenyuk with a pair of assists. So I doubt I got anything in this game. Let's go right to the bottom of the list. There he is. Minus one. Five shots on goal. 
I just can't just can't get any help anymore, can I? I'm going to be put down to the fourth line, I think, again. I think they're going to stick me back down. Because I've got, what, nine points in 11 games? It's not really good, is it? Well, I mean, it is pretty solid, but since I moved up to this line, it's not very good. So, we have a game against the Winnipeg Jets coming up. We have, yeah, we have a very similar record to them, actually. So, here we go. Against Winnipeg, simulate through this game. Hopefully, I'll pick up a point or two. So, Lowry against Merkley for the opening face-off of game two of this episode. First period. Okay, it's a 1-1 game. Keller scores and Line scores. 11 shots to 9 in favour of Winnipeg. Second period. Okay, wow, it's a 4-1 game. Really? Tanev, Wheeler and Camilleri will score. 4-1 in, in favour of the Winnipeg Jets. And third period. Just get us out of our misery. Liam Kirk scores. Hey, we managed to get ourselves our sixth goal of the season. But I think that's all she wrote on that one. So we'll move on to the game against Florida, shall we? Okay, so I gained, wow, 1,300 experience that last week. That's not too bad. Okay, the trade deadline is upon us, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think I'm moving anywhere. But we've got a game against the Florida Panthers. So let's sim the first two periods. Maybe get our 11th point of the season. Dvorak against Trocek for the opening face-off. First period. I can't, oh my god! Jesus! Seven goals! Seven goals on ten shots. So Ekman Larson scored to open the scoring. Then Mulgan scored for the Florida Panthers to get their only goal so far. Then Fisher scored, then Grabner scored. Then Keller scored, then Keller scored. Then Galchenyuk scored, then Panic scored. Oh my god. That's probably got to be one of the best first periods in NHL history. Jesus Christ, I hope I got some points in this bloody game then. Second period. We add another one. Richard Panic gets another one. I've got to have a point in this game at least. I mean, there's eight goals that have already been scored. Come on, game. You've got to cut me some slack here. I've got to go out and get one. Can we hit double digits in this game? God, that's, that's crazy. Can you imagine watching a game and your team allowing seven goals in the first period in an NHL game? It's ridiculous. That's absolutely crazy. Okay, here we go. So, playmaker. Yes, I know my role, coach. I've been a playmaker for quite a while now. Since the start of the series, in fact. Well, I mean, I've kind of scored more goals than I have assisted at the moment. But, you know. So, an 8-1 lead. I think we've got this game on lockdown. I don't think that's going to jinx it, let's be honest. Here we go. So, our line is out. Dvorak and Fisher. So, I must have got at least an assist in this game. That's a great pass. Oh, Montembleau. I really wish he wasn't in the good position for that. Because that would have been a lovely goal. Okay, that was a nice pass, though. Fair play to him. So, start to the shift. Decent play by me. Okay, I'm going to tie you up in the face-off. Good play, boys. Oh, no. No, 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 Payavi. It's mine. Can I have it back, please? Oh, game. You're so mean. I want it back. I want my puck back. Good. Oh, that was an awful pass. I should have seen the defenseman coming in. Um, awful call for a pass is what I mean. Yes! Yes, Dvorak to me! To me! Come on! Let's get revenge! Go! Oh, come on, game! You can't do that to me! Have a player that has a million bloody percent skating come back and push me off the puck so I don't get a chance to do anything. Ah! That's two breakaways now where I've bloody ruined it. Don't embarrass them. Play smart and don't get cocky. I mean, I had the chance on the breakaway if Liam Kirk was just a little bit faster. Oh, God! Right, come on. Here we go. Here we go. I want a goal in this game. McCann. Oh, get out of my way, player. I want to hit him. Okay, good. Good pass. That's a great pass. Okay, why did you stop at the blue line to make a play? You never do that to me. Good, good, good. Oh, come on. Let me get it to the backhand game. I'm really not being able to get the puck to the backhand at the moment. I really don't know why. I'm obviously not doing it quick enough, but I don't really know the difference. Okay, I, I probably shouldn't have done that, but it actually kind of worked out for us. I mean, we're, we're seven goals up. Okay, good, good. Oh, let me take a shot! What is this? Every time I'm going into the offensive zone, I'm trying to make a shot, and it just doesn't happen for one reason or another. It's so irritating. Come on, if I haven't got a point in this game where we scored eight goals on our opponents, I'm not going to be happy. I'm, I must have at least an assist here. At least one. Hopefully on the Fisher goal. 
Okay, that's mine. And I lose it straight away. Wonderful job. Get the puck, boys. Good, Dvorak. Good play. Over to me. Good, off the boards. Low pad... Oh, get out the way, Ekblad. Ah, oh, and then my player can't actually get the puck off him. I am not doing very well at the moment, am I? Just can't get anything going. I'm going through a bit of a slump. Ekblad has an easy shot at the goal because there's no other player to defend him. To me. Lovely. Good job, Fisher. Okay, we've got a back checker. Drew a penalty. There you go. Nice one, Kirky. Drew that hooking penalty. Lovely. So we're going to get some power play time, hopefully. Come on, Kirky. You've got this, boy. 10-15 left in the game. Game three of the episode. This is all you, bud. This is all you. Okay. We've got about a minute left of uh, penalty kill time. I'm just going to get in the way of that. Good play. But power play time, not penalty kill time. What am I on about? Keep it clean. I'll try. Ah, oh, just send it on net, Kirky. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> That's such a pain in the arse. I just can't actually get it on net now. And now they're actually like playing decent hockey. You know, okay. Is this mine? All right. Defensive recovery. Send that pass. Well, that's a good pass. It's a smart play. And that's an awful pass. Come on, boys. Be smart with this, please. Oh, I don't like the look of that. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Good pass. No, you get off me. Okay, good play. Good, right. Go for the line change. I think the coach appreciates that good line change. Thank you very much, coach. I'm trying my best. Right, C plus, B minus, B minus. So I'm doing some good things here. I just need to get myself on the board. I just want to get myself on the board. It's all I need, game. Right, 7.14 left in the third period. Come on, Kirky. You had a few really good chances. You just haven't been able to pull the trigger. Oh my god, that's a decent one-timer attempt. No, Mulgin. You've scored a goal in this game. You don't need any more. Okay, I'm covering my man. Covering my man. Covering my man. Covering my man. Oh, it's a shot and a half, wasn't it? Uh, he's just... Yeah, I mean, you're not really... You're not really covering him, guys. Like, you've actually got to put the effort into go and cover your man. Like me. I'm doing great defensively. So, uh, Vancouver, Detroit, and Anaheim are our next three games after this. Uh, so, the Anaheim game will be the start of next episode. Yes. Okay. Here we go, boys. Barkov is a minus two. That's actually getting off pretty lightly. Gotta be honest. Jesus, that's a shot and a half. No. Good hit. I'm on the move. To me. Lovely. No. 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 Okay, I passed it back, but of course that doesn't count because it's me that did it. You're offside, you pleb. Go away. <laughs> right, 37 seconds on the shift so far, so we're getting towards the end of it. I just want a chance. Come on, game. Oh, I almost took that puck away from them, didn't I? Oh, he tried to tie him up in the face-off, but I was almost there to steal that one. Okay, dumps the puck in. Come on, boys. Get that puck, somebody. Or let them get it. That's fine, too. It's ab okay. What is going on here? Pass it out to me because the area's open. Over to you. Right, I just want one more shift in the offensive zone. Over to me. O pass the puck, Fisher. Okay, tried to get the shot on there. If you'd passed it to me while we were breaking in, I could have had an easy tap into that goal. B minus, B minus across the board. Wonderful. Okay, come on, boys. Get me another shift here, game. One more shift. Wow, another goal. 2.59 left in the third period. Can we make it double digits? Can Kirky's goal be the 10th the goal of the game? Okay, I'm, I'm breaking in. I'm breaking in. Good pass. Wasn't really anything that I could have done there. Back to the defense. That's a great pass. And I don't know where that one was going. I like to think I criticize my, my other teammates just as much as I criticize myself in this game. <laughs> that was not an offensive turnover. Like, come on. I didn't have a chance to do anything with that puck. Ah, This game, man. Right, come on, boys. Ooh, good play, Fisher. And that's an awful pass. And then you take a penalty. Oh, my God. I hope they pull the goalie. <laughs> They're not going to, but it would be nice if they did. So, 134 left in the game. A 9-1 lead for Arizona. And I don't know what happened there. What happened there? Puck just disappeared. All right, fair enough. So, Kirky, let's be smart here, bud. We've got somebody else there able to crash the net. Not that we need them to. Okay, this is my puck. Okay, 
What are you doing? What are you doing, Chitron? You're just a disappointment at the moment. Okay. Oh, get a good play here, fellas. Get a good play. Get Chitron, you're not playing very well to me. Pass the puck to me. You should have passed it instead of cleared it. But, I mean, you're on the penalty kill, so I don't blame you. Petrovic, get hit. Good boy. Oh, and then I take a freaking penalty. Seriously, game? Oh. Right, okay. Looks like I'm going to end the game in the penalty box. So, as the game comes to an end, it is a 9-1 victory for the Arizona Coyotes. What a demolition of the Florida Panthers team. So, offense, I dropped to C+. Team play, I was C+. We were B-minuses across the board at one point in that game. Senses, I lost a load for discipline stuff. Skating, I managed to get a bit more, though, so that's good. So, Galchenyuk with four points, Keller with three points, Panic with three points. Let's see if Liam Kirk actually got any points in this game. He got three assists! There you go! He was a plus two as well. Halla frickin' Luya! So, triple assist game for Liam Kirk. That's much better. That's more of the Liam Kirk we needed. Good job, bud. Good job indeed. I'm very happy with that. Ah, good. That's a good trade deadline game for us. So, we are still fourth place. We're six points back from Calgary. Okay, good to know. So, we're doing alright so far. We're, we're going over a point per game again, I would believe. Because we were nine points in 11 games. We must be, what, 12 points in... Oh, well, maybe we are going a point per game. 12 points in 12 games or something like that. So, another game against the Vancouver Canucks. We beat them recently. Uh, we're going to sim through this one. Hopefully, we win again. Sutter against Stepan for the opening face-off. First period. Wow, we are just going on a goal-scoring phenomenon at the moment. Liam Kirk with the opening goal. Dvorak with one. Polini and Kels. I might have got another assist as well. So, 4 nothing after the first period. We scored seven goals in the first period last game. We scored four in this one. Jesus. 12 shots to nine in favour of Arizona. Second period. Okay, wow, they score two back. Goldobin and Besser score on Ranta. And third period... There you go. A 6-2 game. Fisher scores on Galchenyuk. So I might have got three points in this game. I think that's the max I'll get. Two points. There you go. A goal and an assist in the game for Liam Kirk. A plus three as well. Oh, we're starting to become a plus player. I love it. It's great. So let's fit. Oh, there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, Liam Kirk is moving up to the second forward line of the Arizona Coyotes. This is it, ladies and gents. You have represented the Arizona Coyotes quite well on the third line. So we've decided to give you a crack at the second. We expect a lot more from forwards on the second line in the NHL, though. So you'll have to bring up your game or you won't last long. Make us proud. You know I will, coach. You know I will. So we've won we've won three of the four games we've played so far this episode. We finish off against the Detroit Red Wings. Let's go four or five. Let's do it. Why not? So step on against Nielsen for the opening face-off. First period. Okay, it's a one nothing game to Detroit. The Goose scores on anti-Ranta. Eight shots to seven in favour of Detroit. Second period. Okay, it's a 2 nothing game to them. The Goose scores another one against anti-Ranta. So, a 2 nothing deficit. Liam Kirk, his first game on the second line. Let's see if the British hockey phenom can get the job done. I'm pretty sure we're going over a point per game at the moment. I think we must have like 15 points in 14 games or something like that. Let's see if we can add another one and stay over a point per game. We're not going to win the rookie of the Calder Trophy for Rookie of the Year, but if we have a strong end to the season, I will be happy. So, new line. We're a C-plus in everything to start the period. Makes sense. Let's see if we can get some points on the board for Kirky. Okay, well, okay, so I need to wait till the actual face-off is taken, do I? Oh, no, I'm actually getting a shift straight away. Well, that's interesting. Right, thank you very much. Okay, on the ice we go, and it's a delayed penalty. Got a defensive recovery, though, so that's good. But I am on the penalty kill also, so let's see what happens. Hopefully I get a breakaway and I can actually pull the backhand this time. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Okay, I've got the puck. I've got the puck. I've got the puck. Liam Kirk, lovely job. Oh, no. Okay, managed to take it all the way into the zone, but didn't really make anything of that, did I? Eh, it happens. What can you do? Good play by uh, Connaughton. Okay. Oh, no, sorry, it's Jolmerson, not Connaughton, isn't it? I don't know why I keep thinking it's Connaughton there. Oh, offside. I'm back onside. Good hit on green. Good job there, Kirk. Okay, that's a nice thing. Go get it. Lovely. Right, I'm going to go for a line change. Or not. Okay, I'm going to stay in the zone. Fair enough, then. <laughs> Just get one. I'm going to try my best, coach. Okay. My, my puck, please. Good. Okay. 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 Oh, nope. Lost it. 
Offensive turnover, of course. Even though we're on the penalty kill. Oh, careful. No, he's right in front of the goal. Where's the defense there, fellas? Wow. So, C plus is still. Technically, that wasn't my fault. And I, I agree. It wasn't my fault. <laughs> so, 17.35 left in the third period. Well, excuse me. Can you get Pellini out of the way? Right, go. Okay, still on the ice for Derek Stepper. That's a great pass. Okay, I tried to take a shot. I knew I wouldn't have much time to take it. And it's blocked. Yay! Right, okay. To me, panic. Good. Wow, okay. Get absolutely rocked. Cheers, dude. Right. Let's try and pick this up a little bit, please, Kirky. You're not really doing very much at the moment. Good poke check. Even though that's not the play you're supposed to be covering. Okay. Another shot attempt there. Can we keep this out? Maybe, yep. Step on, you're playing on the second line? Okay, I don't know what happened with that pass there. Okay. Oh, come on, of course. He just can't squeak it past the defenseman. And of course, that's my fault for calling the pass. Okay, C plus is all across the board still. We're three goals down here. We could really do with something good here, fellas. If they could get one before my next shift, I'd be much appreciated. Nope, okay then. I just want to get on the board. I'm looking at my own stats at the moment now. I should be focusing on the team, but when you're 3 nothing down, let's just focus on my own stats. Get off the ice. Why is that a bug every single time there's a line change? Oh, crash the net. <laughs> there you go. Okay, so 13-36 left. Face off in the offensive zone. Let's crash this face off. Going to crash his face off because I knew it was going to happen, something like that. And I still can't come away with the puck. Wonderful. <laughs> oh, God. All right, careful, fellas. Careful. Careful. Panic. Can you please be careful with this puck? Okay. I'm not really sure what they're wanting to do with this. Step on. That's mine. No. Okay. Who's got it? Can we stop bloody bobbling the puck around, please? It's not a beach ball. Like, just keep it on the ice and get a decent job. Right, good. Come on. Howard's made 18 saves in the game. Really? Only 18 shots on goal? And I go in for the poke check there, and it does absolutely nothing. Good play. Defensive recovery. Nice. And off we go. Over to you, Jarmusson. You're welcome. That was a waste of it. Nice one, bud. Okay, Danny DeKaiser get hit, bud. Right, line change. Just want to do what the coach asks me to. I'm trying to get points up there. I'm trying to get chances, but my line mates aren't really helping me at the moment. They just keep bobbling the puck, puck about and making silly passes. In fairness, some of them are because I'm calling for silly passes, but not all of them. It used to be all of them, but not all of them anymore. I'm a changed man. Get off the ice. Thank you. Right, let's go. What are we doing? What are you doing? Oh my god. Can you actually learn how to move the puck, fellas? God, my junior team was better at this than you guys are. Right, let's go. Okay. Well, I covered him up up enough to get Ekman Larson into the zone. He makes an awful deke and has the puck taken off him. Hello, Nyquist. Get hit, please. Okay, it's mine. It's my puck. Lovely. Good, good poke check. That poke check was key. Don't know why I passed it there. I pressed the right trigger to call for the pass. But as I was doing it, obviously, they decided to move the puck. Stepan, what are you doing? Can I go back on the third or fourth line? Because those guys can actually play hockey. Whereas these guys just seem to play like crap. Right, careful. Careful. Good play. I'm covering my man. Good. Right, skate to the bench. No. I've got a date with Destiny. She's a lovely woman. Oh, shot attempt. Just get it on net, please, Kirk. I mean, if I hadn't have been blocked in front, it would have gone high and wide anyway, most likely. So, there you go. I tried my best. <laughs> it's just all falling apart, fellas. I don't want to get shut out. So, 6-11 left in the period. Get off the ice, Polini. Thank you. Okay, let's pass it back and have another neutral zone trap. That's really going to help us. Hey, Green. I wanted to hit you, but you moved out of the way, you little pussy. <laughs> right, come on, boys. Cover my man. My man is officially being covered. Okay, he's not anymore, but now he is. Okay, may maybe not. I thought he was being covered, but I guess not. 
How are we not getting any of these pucks? I, I just don't get it. Okay, that should have been a pass. That should have been an actual pass. I'm going for a line change. Screw this. Right, C plus is all across the board still. I just want one decent shift. Is that too much to ask, game? Apparently it is. 3.54. Wasn't that just the time that I left? Or was that five minutes something? I guess it was five minutes something. Get off the ice, Polini. Oh my god. That bug is so irritating. That was a lovely deke by Larkin, though. Step on, step on, step on. You're meant to be one of the best players on this team. Can you show it, please? I knew I, knew I was going to get hit on that. I knew that was going to happen. Hit you into your bloody team. Right. Careful. What are you doing, boys? Okay. Over to you, Chitra. And that was a great pass, though. Why do we keep doing this? Why do we keep doing this at the blue line? Why does everybody stack up and we wait for the last person to go in? It just doesn't make any sense. You keep forcing offsides. Like, come on. Okay, I'm going to go for a line change. Carolina beat Florida 6-1. Wow. They've had some tough losses these last few games. So I might get one more shift in this. It's not going to be that eventful, I would imagine. 136 left. As long as we don't pull our goalie and we allow a goal and I get another minus. Right, I'm out on the ice. Justin Abdelkader. Okay, it's mine. Good play. Made some very good plays there. I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay, step on. What are you doing? You're just embarrassing yourself now. Pass to you. Why don't you just take a shot defense? Why don't you just take a shot defense? Well, I, I, I don't get it. Okay, back to the defense. Oh, decent attempt there. Okay. Right, we've got the last minute of the game. Right, let's go. To me. Oh, of course that was going to be intercepted. God damn it. Right, C plus, B minus, C plus. That was a really uneventful game for me. I, I, made, I did some good things, did some bad things, just like the rest of the team, pretty much. There were some passes they should have made to me. There were some shots they should have scored, just like me. And there were some things that they did well. So, C+, plus, B-, minus, C+, plus in that game. Yeah, that was, that was a really uneventful game for me. I uh, lost a bit on puck skills, senses, skating, and defense. We gained some, but I got rocked, so I, I didn't really get anything from that. But a 3-0 victory for the Detroit Red Wings in the final game of this episode. The commentary for this last game probably wasn't as interesting as some of the other ones. Because I didn't really know what to say. Like, nothing was happening. So, if we just sim up to our next game, which is against the Anaheim Ducks. Uh, 800 experience this week. Not too bad. Are we at 71 overall yet? No, we are not. We're on the second line, second power play unit. We're getting some time. We're not on the shootout lineup, though, which sucks. Um, but if we take a look at our points for this season so far. Wow, 49 points is our best. That's awful. So we don't have to go that far down. 15 points in 15 games and we're a plus three. Hey, hey. nice. That's not too bad. We've got 11 penalty minutes on the season. Uh, 41 shots on the season, which isn't too bad. But yeah, 15 points in 15 games. A point per game for Liam Kirk. He's risen up into the top six from the fourth line in the space of two episodes. So maybe next episode he gets up to the first line if he starts playing well. But I think it might take a little bit of time for him to adjust to his second line teammates. But yes, I'm going to end this episode here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed. Please feel free to like, subscribe, share, or watch some of my other videos. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.